It's okay for me. Then I'll use this way. Then I'll click OK. That is beautiful. Then I want to change the color over here. Then I'll come and click this layer. Then I'll come to F X. Then I'll click. Then I'll go to where? I'll go to gradient. I want to make it a gradient. So I'll click over here. Then I'll have a gradient panel pop up. Then I'll choose any color over here. This one. I don't want it so I have to change the color so I have to click over here then I'll change the color to this it's okay for me then I'll come back here then I'll go over and change the color again again to this then it's okay then you try you can try moving this one in to have that particular color down there then then that is 90 uh, make it zero to have something like this is beautiful then after that you click ok then this is what we have then the first now to come and pick the E over here and come and bring it on this you are making a logo like that but I have to change this one I don't like it this way so I'll use logo the font the font should be logo logo what logo block 2 this one is beautiful. I want it this way. I want it this way. Then I'll increase it. Okay. Okay, this way. It's okay for me. Then I'll change the color to what? White. This way. Beautiful. So I'll have something like this. I'm creating a, 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 a logo just like that. Very simple. Then I'll come and click this uh, rectangular distance tool here. Then I'll come and click ellipse tool. Then I'll come and draw a perfect circle by holding shift and drag it's okay yes so when you draw something like that then you now move it on top and say it should be somewhere here it's okay for you then you change the color you click on that particular thing this one just this one then you double click and you come then you choose a red i like red then you choose red okay then you now come and type in TV. Okay, I want it to be capitals TV this way. Okay, so you use your your keyboards, the left and right, the down, this thing to move it in. Then you change the color. When you click on the characters, you change the color to white. White this way. So when you check on this, I just use only two, two, uh, what, two, uh, what is the name? Two fonts on this particular this thing. Then I use uh, two, two fonts. Yes, two fonts for this. Then the colors I use one, two, three. Simple. That is how we design what a logo for a client. So this after doing this. Uh, you just group all in there and that's all you design it so then you save then you click I want to save it on desktop then this way then you click you have done that like that you have done a good job thank you very much for following my youtube tutorials make sure you check on my youtube channel to get more videos because i'll be coming up with more videos on photoshop this time around yes thank you very much for watching don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel like share share to your friends you know let everyone know that abm graphics is here to help you learn photoshop good advanced advanced i want each and every person who want to like for who want to learn photoshop to be a pro you know an, an, an advanced person when it comes to photoshop thank you very much for watching bye bye see you in the next video